Right, so what is up guys, SDPZ here, and today we're bringing you back another Minecraft video in the series. I'm actually really uh, excited for this coming back. Um, hopefully you guys are too, and you did enjoy, but it looks like you enjoyed the last video, so hopefully you're as excited as it seems you are. I am just cooking up some uh, meat here. Oh, I've actually made it really dark, so let's go and stand by a torch. Um, I am just cooking up myself some here food because we're still in the mine shaft from last episode i haven't actually gone back home yet but what i have done and slightly found off camera is literally if i move this torch and just put it here i have a spider spawner right there and there's another one literally like just around the corner i found two it's, it's uh, somewhere around here there's literally two Within inches of each other. So cave spider spawners. So what I'm going to do is hopefully this time I'm going to find a spawner. I mean look there's a hell of a lot of them down there. Hopefully this time we're going to find a spawner. With hopefully some chests. You never know. Maybe. I might get lucky this time. Uh, hopefully finally get some carrots so we can start breeding our pigs. What I am going to definitely do is just disable it for a minute because there's a hell of a lot of them. And at the minute, I'm probably going to get clapped because there literally is like shit loads of them. Um, there is another one. There it is. Look, it's literally right there. But they're actually everywhere. Like, it's mad. The so I don't understand how how like two spawners can spawn so close to each other. We've disabled that one. So what we're going to do is try and head up here to this one. I think there's another one in the distance over there as well. Is that am I seeing that right? Oh my god, there's another one. What the hell is this place? This is like Spider Central. What the hell is this place, man? Somehow, even with all this... Uh, absolutely no chests, which is a bit of a joke, I'm not going to lie. Um, I was hoping maybe by coming to these... Uh, by literally become, by coming to where all these spawners are, we might actually get ourselves a chest. Because uh, I really could do with those carrots, so I could start breeding pigs in this game. Because obviously that's something we definitely want to be doing. I literally want a constant lookout, because there is... All I can hear in my headset is just literal constant spider noises and I'm gonna be honest with you it's kind of creeping me out what the what is that what is, what what's he doing down here I'm pretty sure that's like the the geezer who like does all the trading with me at the start what the hell is he doing down here okay we've been poisoned okay that's a lot of spiders I'm suddenly not okay with this. Okay, right, chill, chill, chill. Let's just chill for a sec. This suddenly became not so okay. I'm just gonna take these torches because it seems like I've put torches everywhere for like no apparent reason. I'm just like absolutely flying through them like I've got them to waste. Um, okay, where did I come from? I came from up there, did I? I feel like I came from up there. No. Came from not down there, up there, yeah, up here, right. Oh, it's just so creepy. All I can hear is literally just like constant spider noises. I'm not cool with it. It's kind of creeping me out. I'm not gonna lie. We're just gonna put a torch down so we can see what we're doing. We found a nice little bit of gold here, some more iron. Uh, so yeah. It's a bit of an interesting area. Literally, it's like spider 
heaven for some reason. Don't ask me why, because I literally don't have a clue. But I don't know why what this guy's doing down here. He actually is like my wandering trader geezer. Like, what is he doing down here? Coral block. What the hell is that? A sea pickle. I could actually trade some of my... I kind of want to see what that is. Not going to lie. I, I've, so I've done some little trades. Because I did pick up some emeralds, obviously, earlier on. I just want to literally take that. Because that looks really, really cool. Whatever that pinky sort of coral block is. It just looks cool. So I feel like that's definitely worth giving a whirl. Um, but I think I've somehow... No, I tell a lie. I can hear so many spiders really close by. I'm kind of... It's literally creeping me out, man. Like My headset is literally just like spider noises. It's really, really weird. Like, I'm not okay with it. If I go back here, I end up back where I was. Yeah, I'm pretty much back where I was now. At Spider Central. Which is creepy. But, you know, we can roll with it. No, no geezers. Leave me alone. Not today, lads. Right, okay. I am so lost in the in this... Mineshaft, it's a joke. Like, I genuinely don't have a clue where I am. What the hell is that? Kind of needs to get a thumbnail here. Absolute army of spiders. Like, what is going on here? This could be some sick XP. Hang on. Let's turn the HUD back on. Now we've got our thumbnail. Let's just clap all these geezers up. What do they fancy doing, lads? Absolute cave spider XP farm. What's going on? Why is there so many of them? There's literally like a full-on army going on here. Like, what the hell? I've never seen anything like this. It's really creepy. Why was there so many when I walked around the corner? There's still so many of them. What the hell? This is really weird. Oh, I've got... There's got to be like another spawner really close by. Otherwise, why is there so many? More just keep appearing. I don't even know where they're coming from. Where are these even coming from? Why is there so many spiders? What the hell? I really do with finding, like, if there is a spawn, I really do with finding it. Uh, and hopefully it's got chests in it. Because at the minute, we're just finding shed loads of spiders for like what seems to be literally no apparent reason what the hell's down there right what i'm gonna do for sure is make some more torches um okay i need to make some sticks first but that's cool we can do that let's make Let's let's turn all of our stuff into sticks, so I can just like, so I'm not stuck with another item. So I'm, as you can see, our inventory is a little bit full. I'm kind of struggling um, on the old items front. I have somehow made 64 torches. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, we'll just leave four of them behind. That's cool. We've got 64 torches now for some reason. But uh, do you know what? That's okay. Yeah, I might actually die here.
I'm actually really close to dying. What the hell is going on? I might actually die here. I'm not even joking. May actually die. No. Oh. Okay. Way too close for comfort. Way, way, way too close. Wasn't a fan of what just happened there. Not gonna lie. Let's take this emerald here. And go this way. I must be like really near. So how am I not near a spawner of some description? I'm gonna mine. All right, I'll catch up in a second. I'm gonna mine this way because I'm sure I can hear one. Oh my god. I think I've just found I think I've just accidentally found the stronghold. Yes. Yeah. Oh my god, there's silverfish. I think I've accidentally just found the stronghold. Or have I? Hang on, let me do some digging and I'll get back to you. Okay, update. I found another chest. Oi! Golden apples! Jeez! And some more torches, some coal you'll have to see. Okay, we're really gonna have to ditch some stuff here. Um, I ain't never gonna use a detector rail, I know that, and if I am, I shall just craft one. Um, they can stay behind, that can stay behind. Oh, this is kind of tough, you know. We'll take the torches because literally they're always useful. Can I turn down melon seeds as a laser beam fan? Probably not. Let's take those old me melon seeds. So I clearly haven't explored this bit before then. And I thought I'd nearly, f I thought I'd pretty much done everywhere. So I'm actually a bit confused. I was if I just built it there and it's a dead end. Let's go for an explore. Okay, I found my I'm pretty sure I, have I seen this before? I feel like I've seen this area before. I can't all I want to do now literally is just like try and get out. Like I'll know where it is on the map obviously. So if I ever like want to come back, I can always literally just hop in my boat and come back here because I'll just be able to find it on my map. Okay, we're not going out yet though, because I've just spotted a chest. Come on. Come on, carrots. Come on, carrots. Please. Come on, please. That's all I'm asking for. Oh, it's a chest I've already been in. Because I've dumped loads of crap in there. Oh, yeah, I have been near this area. Okay, so at least I know where I am. Um, sort of. We just what we think we're gonna do is just go here, go for a risky bit of iron, but we got it. It's cool. Um, I think we'll just. I mean, we found loads of obsidian and some redstone. So I mean, I'll take some redstone. I'm gonna need it at some point. Um, obviously, with uh, getting all these rails, obviously I do. It has given me two. Powered rails, but I'm also going to need more than that for my minecart system that we will build at some point. Don't know yet when, but at some point we will build a sick minecart system. Uh, we've found some gold here, so we'll, we'll take a bit of gold. You know, we never complain about gold. But what I think I'm trying to do now is sort of get out of here. Which is actually a lot harder than it sounds. I'm really struggling, I'm not going to lie. Uh, I genuinely can't find my way out. Um, obviously not ideal. But I think what I might do is literally just catch up with you. When I'm out of here, um, and once I've sort of... Well, at least I'll catch up with you once I can see the... Um, oh, okay. 
I won't catch up with you and I can see the ravine because I've just found the ravine. Absolutely decent timing. Okay. Okay, I know where I, I know where I am now, I suppose. As a spawner here, should we I mean for a laugh, let's have a look if there's any chests here. There definitely won't be because it's simply my luck. Clapped. All I want is some little carrots. I just know it's not going to give it to me though. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. So what we're what we're probably going to do is we're probably just going to head on home. Uh, unless I spot anything cool, I'm, I mean I could always get that gold, but you know it's, it's not the it's not the biggest thing in the world. What I'm going to do is aim over here because the stream of water, that one there, which looks like it goes at least sort of near the top. So I feel if we aim for that, we're in sort of at least a good sort of area. Um, what we will do actually while we're down here, we might as well as uh, so we'll just go. Exploring over here for a minute. Oh, we've got some more iron. You love to see it. Love a bit of iron. Basic materials, you know, but it's useful. We're going to need it to go back to the nether, so... It's always appreciated. That's literally what the point of this episode is, is finding the sort of... Well, it's not the point of the episodes at the minute, but the idea is we're sort of trying to find the materials so that we can soon, at some, well, at some point soon, go back to the nether... Uh, and take our revenge for what happened last time. Um, what I'll do is, you know what, we'll leave that iron behind for now. Or I'll leave some stuff for if we ever come back. What we're going to do is head up on out of here. So as you can see, there's the ravine behind me. It was really cool. Um, like, really, really cool. I didn't expect to find anything like this on this world, I'm not even going to lie, because this world, I mean, let's be honest, it was pretty poor. I kind of want to go... Do I? Do I want to go back in? Okay, I do, there's a chest just there, so we're going to aim for that chest. That's going to be... The next little mini goal is we're going to go for this chest here. And there we go. We've sort of nearly made it already. Bloody skeleton boss. Look at him and his bloody... He knows he looks cool. Go on, lad. See you later. Who's that geezer think he is? Who does he think he is having the right to do that? Don't think so, mate. What is going on here? What is this what is this Donnie's problem? What the hell is that? Is that a massive bat? What is that? What is this Donnie's problem? Right, hang on. Let's go and sort him out. Ooh, that was close. Oh my god, that was close. We literally only just caught that water. Oh god, that could... Seriously. I mean, after the things that have happened in this series... And how I've just about put up with them. And believe me, just about, I very nearly quit when I fell in lava and lost everything in the nether. That would have topped it. That would have been end of series moment. Because there's absolutely no way I'm doing it again. Whew, Jesus Christ. Okay, come on. Back, let's go. All I wanted to do was get a chest. I mean, for God's sake, I wasn't asking for much. I just want to duck into here. And get this chest. Okay, and that is why, because we've got another golden apple. We got... What What are these then? Okay, 
We've got powered rails, which is what I actually wanted, so no complaints there. We're just going to leave the bread behind because we don't really need it. Um, I mean, I feel like there's... Is there, is there more exploring worth doing now? Now I've found a new area. Or do I just leave this for if I ever come back? Am I going to do too much and make this place somewhere like I can't come back because I've explored like every last bit of it? Do I want to do that? I feel like I don't. I feel like I, I want to leave this place now. Uh, maybe leave some of it to the imagination for next time. Rather than literally just taking everything this place has to offer. Maybe just wait for next time when I've got uh, a bit more inventory space, obviously, because at the minute we're carrying a heavy inventory. And the last thing I need to do is risk what I currently have. Because it is currently saving the series, everything we've found here. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, everything we currently have could save the series. Because um, it was looking pretty ropey after the last episode where we lost everything. So at the minute, can't complain, is all I'm going to say. Yeah, there's a lot left to do here. Like, I haven't even touched this site, because obviously I was I spent my whole... Oh my god. Okay, wow. There's a lot of stuff going on in this cave that I didn't even know existed. I literally just was on the other side of the cave. Um... I mean, okay then. I mean, if it... He's kind of asking me to explore it now. Do I even have a choice? Wait, I don't know where I am. I'm stuck. Actually, no, forget it. Right, forget it, forget it, forget it. Right, stop exploring, stop exploring, George. Save something for you to actually do next time you come here. Because at the minute, I'm going to just end up exploring everything and have nothing to do next time. Which we kind of don't want. Because um, we do, I do want to be able to come back here and use this um, again uh, in future future episodes, or even even if it's just literally off camera that I end up using it, um, just so at least I have like a place that I know I can go farm resources there. Because I'm going to have literally barely scratched the surface in terms of what probably is here. Um, so I think what we could, what we'll do for now is we'll leave it. But we'll leave it with the idea of we'll definitely be coming back. 100%. Whether it's off camera or on camera, I will be coming back here to explore the rest of this place. Because, I mean, it looks pretty insane. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, considering that like now I've realised I pretty much only did sort of like one side of it all. And I've kind of got a whole another side of the map of like this ravine to look through kind of entices me a hell of a lot to come back so he didn't want the smoke well we're up to actually uh, we've gone up to like nearly 10 levels so you can't complain but i am definitely going to go home now so what i'll probably do is just catch up with you when i get back to home base if i do actually guys in fact as per usual i've just somehow got a little bit lost um i'll probably need to go back and watch last episode see what way i came in from what coordinates i need to be aiming for because um, I think I'm definitely a little bit lost here. So what I'm going to do is call it a day here. We've had another successful episode in the mineshaft. we found a lot of cool things. Uh, and also we're now going to head home and maybe next episode, um, who knows, we might get some cool stuff done. Maybe uh, back at the farm or maybe we'll go back to the nether. You never know. But hopefully you've enjoyed another episode of this Minecraft series. If you are enjoying it, please drop a like on the video. It is also appreciated. Subscribe if you're new around here and click that notification bell so you never miss an upload of mine. I upload it every day at 6pm. Thank you very much for watching. Peace.